speeds and distances. Boat wake and noise out in the open ocean isn't a big problem, but in a confined area it is a problem. Boat wake and noise caused by speed can do more than just harass and annoy other people. Wake and wash can cause damage to people, boats and pens, the riverbank, and even wildlife. Yep, even wildlife. Wildlife is swans and ducks, ducklings, duck nests, eggs, and so on. Even dolphins are wildlife, and they get hit by boats. There are particular places we must stay under eight knots. Eight knots is a common speed for you to remember. You must stay under eight knots, within 15 meters of another moving boat. You must stay under eight knots, within 50 meters of a jetty, a wharf, a person in the water, a moored vessel, riverbank, or low water mark. So that's under eight knots, inside 15 meters from another moving boat, and stay under eight knots, within 50 meters of a jetty, wharf, moored vessel, a person in the water, riverbank, or low water mark. Know these numbers. Eight knots, 15 meters, boats. Eight knots, 50 meters, other things. Wake and wash. The wake is the waves that spread out from your boat as you move along. And wash is the turbulent water behind your boat. The wash can drag smaller things. If you are less than 15 meters from another boat, what speed must you stay under? Eight knots. What is wake and wash? Wake is the waves, wash is the turbulent water. Can wake and wash damage boats in pens? Yes. Can wake and wash damage the riverbank? Yes. Can wake and wash harm wildlife? Yes. What speed must you stay under if closer than 50 meters from a wharf? Eight knots. What speed must you stay under if less than 50 meters from a jetty? Eight knots. What speed must you stay under if you are closer than 50 meters from a person in the water? Eight knots. What speed must you stay under if you are less than 50 meters from a moored vessel? Eight knots. What speed must you stay under if you are less than 50 meters from a river bank? Eight knots. What speed must you stay under if you are less than 50 meters from low water mark? Eight knots. Also, the maximum speed when the water is less than three meters deep is eight knots. When in doubt, stay under eight knots. And remember, we go slow for many reasons, including wildlife. If the water is less than three meters deep, what speed must you stay under? Eight knots. Avoid collision. There's also a rule that says that you must travel at a speed that will give you time to maneuver to avoid a collision. So, no matter what someone else does, you must always be able to avoid a collision. So eight knots within 15 meters of another moving boat, 50 meters from other things is a good guide to allow you time to safely stop. And you should also slow down to keep your vessel's wake to a minimum when passing near boats in pens, boats on moorings, ducks and swans nests, dolphins, etc. Learn these. They are important numbers you need to know.